today I bring you a really easy tip to work out if your grip matches your release. So making sure that you're square at impact. I'm Curtis, I'm a teacher professional at Adlington Driving Range and I'm here to help you strike the ball better. T and your glove. So all we're going to do is stick the glove in this part here. So this allows oh, try and get it. It's going to stick out like this. From this point, this is going to work out whether you're coming open or close at impact. So this left wrist is really important. It looks a little bit like this. We're going to take a normal stance, and as you can see, this or if I was if you were more down the line, this would be hitting at impact. So as you're swinging, you can then work out whether the face would be open, so it's now pointed that way, or closed when the T-peg's aiming this way. So working out where the face is pointed will allow you to hit that ball straighter and a lot closer to the target. Your tip um, to get the awareness of where your face is at impact. And the key to this is to when you're swinging through, is to hold that position, hold that impact position that allows you to see where the club face is, then make adjustments and then try and again return back to where you've made that adjustment to consistently. If you're able to do it consistently, then you're going to be able to hit that ball better on target every single time.